write the equation of the vertical line that passes through the point negative 7 2 so a vertical line means let me show you over here okay x axis y axis y axis has equation x equals 0 so our line is a vertical line so it will be somewhere to the right or left here in fact negative 7 2 so it passes through here for any let's talk about any vertical line okay if it passes through a point let's say a comma b any vertical line it could be here on the right side of y axis or on the left side then equation will be this is a b means this distance is a okay so the equation of this line will be x equals this distance because the slope is undefined so for vertical line this will be x equals first coordinate which is negative 7 okay horizontal line slope 0 so we have this situation now like this one if we know this passes through a b then this distance is b so the y distance is b so for horizontal line it will be y equals second coordinate x coordinate y coordinate so y equals 2 and what is the slope of a vertical line okay vertical line the slope is undefined because slope is rise over run for a vertical line there is no run that's why undefined what is the slope of a horizontal line like this one we have run, we have run but there is no rise because horizontal means all the time same height there is no rise so rise zero over something so this zero basically zero okay just the number zero now 26 write the equation of the line so equation of the line all the time y equals mx plus b we need to find the slope first then use a given point to determine b okay that cons that contains the points this one and this one we have two points from the two points we can find the slope yeah okay let's find the slope first slope is change in y coordinate rise over run that means change in y coordinates divided by change in x coordinates so change in y coordinates means y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 you don't have to write this formula basically change in y coordinates so negative 3 minus 9 over 5 minus negative 4 so this is negative 3 minus 9 both negative negative 12 5 minus minus plus 4 5 plus 4 9 so 12 over 9 maybe we can put in this it's smallest terms 3 goes 3 times 3 goes 4 times so negative 4 thirds so we found the slope of our line then the equation is y equals mx plus b so m is negative 4 thirds x plus b okay we are almost done now we need to determine the value of b to determine the value of b we know this line passes through these two points we can use any of these two points okay let's use the first using uh, negative 4 9 we get x is negative 4 y is 9 so y is 9 equals negative 4 over 3 times x x is negative 4 plus b we are trying to <coughs> find the value of b okay so 9 equals multiply these two numbers negative negative positive you don't have to write 4 times 4 16 over 3 plus b now subtract 16 over 3 from both sides then b equals 9 minus 16 over 3 okay 9 is same as how many thirds this is 16 thirds so 9 is same as 27 thirds because 3 divides 27 9 times so this is 27 thirds minus 16 thirds so 27 thirds minus 16 thirds is 27 minus 16 11 thirds 
okay so 9 minus 16 thirds is in fact 11 thirds so b equals 11 thirds we are done thus y equals mx plus b we are doing here now negative 4 over 3x plus b b is 11 over 3 plus 11 over 3 final